In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called factoring a perfect square trinomial with leading coefficient one. In this example, we're asked to factor u squared minus six u plus nine. And as described, this is a perfect square trinomial. And that just means that it has a specific form that says whenever the first term and the trinomial is a perfect square, and the last term is a perfect square, and the middle term is plus or minus two times the product of those two before they are squared. When we factor, the result will be a perfect square, and the sign will be the same as that middle sign. So with this form, we can look at our example here and see if we can write it in that perfect square trinomial form. First, looking at the leading term, can I write it as a perfect square? It's already u squared, but to emphasize that, I'll write it as u being squared. Doing the same for the last term, which also needs to be a perfect square, can I write that as something squared? Nine can be written as three squared, and then in the middle, this minus 6u, can I write that as minus 2 times the product of these two? So 2 times, I've got a numerical 3 in the variable u. Yes, we can see that this trinomial is a perfect square trinomial. So that means that we'll be able to use this factored form indicated here to jump straight to the factored form on the right hand side, which says that this will be equal to a perfect square where the first part is a, and in our example, that's the variable u. The plus or minus is determined by the middle sign. Our middle sign is minus, so we'll use minus. And then the last term, b, is also indicated here as three. So since we were able to recognize this form for a perfect square trinomial, we're able to jump directly to the factored form by just following this formula, identifying the a and b, being careful with the signs, and now we've factored the perfect square trinomial. 